Hello, 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 beautiful people out there in YouTube land. How are you all? My name is Grace, and I am here to submit an entry for the Genesis Genesis Virgin Hair um, Fabulous Dress Up Contest. How are you all? Uh, like I said, my name is Grace, and I'm here to fill, um, put in this entry. And I am pretty, not pretty new to YouTube. I've been a member for a while. I am actually a... Uh, I would declare myself a huge junkie. I love hair, I love skin, I love nails, I love taking care of myself as a woman. And oh, I was about to put my earrings on, I'm sorry guys, give me a second. <laughs> so I'll put on my earrings. Like I said, I am a self-declared YouTube junkie. I love taking care of myself as a woman. I love hair, skin, and nails. And so I love watching um, other YouTubers, positive women who, um, give a lot of advice on those things and help us along our journey um, they have been a great deal of help to me um you know in fashion and hair and makeup and different things like that and so I've actually also heard really great reviews about the Genesis Virgin Hair Company so I thought why not this is my first video but um why not put in a video about um, the outfit I'm wearing tell you all about my inspiration tell you all where my outfit came from and um i hope you all like it and i hope you'll enjoy watching it so as you all know it is actually i'm submitting my entry on september 11th yes i know guys the contest ends tomorrow but <laughs> i thought why not get in where i fit in i actually found about i find out about it not too long ago so september is here which means unfortunately summer is going bye bye and um, the fall is rolling in, followed by the winter, and I actually go to school in Boston, so it gets cold here pretty quickly. So um, I'm, I'm kind of sad to kiss the summer goodbye, but I'm also ready for the fall to come with bundling and sweaters and cute jackets and layering and all that good stuff. So I decided for my look today to hold on to the summer spirit um, in terms of colors and um like you see the makeup, there are a lot of shades of pinks and purples and you know, different things like that. But my outfit was also inspired by a pair of shoes that I bought, um, I would say last year sometimes. Some people may call them vintage or last season, but those are my babies <laughs> and I love them. So I looked at them and I said, why not? Let's pick an outfit that goes with that. So I'm going to pick up my shoes for you all and show you all where my inspiration came from. And then I will take a step back and let you all see my outfit and tell you all about my outfit. So these are my babies. My beautiful, beautiful babies. They are a pair of dollhouse shoes, like I said, that I bought last year. They are fuchsia colored with some intricate details along the heel, bottom heel, um, so, I would say the heel may be about like four or five inches high, I don't know, but I love them, and so, like I said, this really inspired my outfit, in terms of the makeup, and so my outfit, let me take a step back, I don't know if y'all can see, just my camera, just a little bit. This is my outfit. I'll tell you about the components of my outfit. This dress is actually a dress that I got from H&M as a gift from one of my friends, a birthday gift. It is a short dress. I will take a picture, a full length picture of it so y'all can see. Uh, it's very short. It has a little frilly um, tulle bottom. And like I said, it's very summery with prints and that type of thing. But you could also dress up a dress like this if you didn't want to wear it with sandals or flats. You could dress it up with shoes, um, heels like I have there. And also, if you also wanted to um, add a sophisticated air to the dress, you know, after going to the movies or on your way to a date night with um, a boyfriend or a significant other, or even out to a little girls' night dinner, whatever you want to do. You can also pair it with a sweater, like I decided to do. This is a fuchsia sweater that I got from Charlotte Russe. Um, can't 
telling you exactly when I bought it. It was a while ago. But it's a fuchsia sweater, like I said, that I got from Chargers. And I bought that. And I actually like to add this to the dress just because, um, yeah, not that, it, not that the dress is immature, but, you know, sometimes I have little issues wearing very short clothing, so I feel like it just makes me, makes it less, as you know, abrasive. People are like, why are they walking around, why is she walking around with that little dress? So, yeah, so I decided to pair this with it, and I kept my accessories to a minimum, just because, you know, wanted the dress really to stand out and the shoes are crazy by themselves so you don't really sometimes you don't need too much and I, these are actually some button earrings that I got from just a little roadside um, jewelry store I saw them and I thought they were really interesting looking and cool I don't know if you can see the details they kind of swirl just a little bit so I thought they were cool and I bought them not too much money I think maybe one dollar two dollars decided to do that um you could do like a little statement I think if you really want to I like I said I don't like to keep it simple just show off my shoes so that is my outfit some heels from Dollhouse this nice little fuchsia sweater from um Charlotte Rose with a summer dress from ancient Room and some stud earrings in terms of the makeup NYX um lip gloss African Queen. The eyes are a mix of um, just some colors from my 188 palette and then also the main colors are this pinkish fuchsia color you see here. That's all this is. Um, outline here is from the Hip High Intensity Pigments um, Mineral Eyeshadow. I think I believe the duo is called Pinky. No, Cheeky. That's it. It's called Cheeky. And then I have um just a nude shimmer of um almost like a little highlight i can't remember what it's called but if i find it i'll let you all know so this is my fabulous little outfit i hope you all enjoyed thanks for watching and um quickly as i as you know i also said that this is today's september 11th so i just wanted to observe or um remember many of the families, victims, anyone who was affected by September 11th. Uh, as, um, like I said, I go to school in Boston. I'm in college right now, so it's pretty young when it did happen. But um, I just encourage you all to just reflect on all the blessings that you have in your life. And, um, and to all the families who were affected by the tragedy, to just remember to, I guess, not look, not dwell on the past and all the negative emotions that were and the hatred and the anger that um triggered the attacks but to focus on the future really and focus on all the positivity and the blessings that you know you're blessed with and about the life that your loved ones would have wanted you to live so i hope you all enjoyed the video and thanks for watching